Hello everyone, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Today we're back in American Truck. We have, uh, this is Outlaws 379. It was just released over on one of the mod sites, so it looks like he is back. Today the truck's running a, uh, Cummins 444. 525 horses, it has a 18-speed eating full of transmission. And we've got, uh, we've got one of the new trailers that was coming the 1. 1.36 update, which is a, a grain hopper. We're heading down to Albuquerque, New Mexico. We're in Flagstaff, Arizona. So let's get on the road. I don't use this truck much, guys. So I seen it, and I said, "Well, I, I'm on. I want to use it. I hadn't used it in a long time." So, I'm going to talk to you about what's been going on, uh, why there hasn't really been anything on the channel. I will make another video of ATS. I'm going to do one with the uh, SCS truck, which is mostly what I use. Um, I've just been working, um, working Turn crazy light. hours. Um, also... Right before Red Dead Redemption 2 come out on PC, I used GeForce Spirits. I used their graphics Go card. Go straight on. And the graphics card, when they updated the graphics card for Red Dead, it made everything laggy. You couldn't play it. It was so laggy. I mean, every game was so laggy. It just wasn't. It wasn't used to worth playing. It was bad. Even this game, it was really really laggy um, they finally updated it they fixed their issues uh, don't mind that on top of the screen I don't think that's right that's supposed to be a um, frame rate counter but I I think it's getting a lot more now it would have to be So yeah, I've uh, seen this truck on one of the sites, um, thought I'd run it. I can say it does have a lot of options, it, ha it does have more than Viper has for his truck, which I haven't used this truck since it's been updated. So I don't know, he may have added more things, don't know. Gonna have to check it out and see. Oh, uh, we hit a truck. Oh well. That was my fault. I was talking when paying attention. Start this video off right. Hitting the car. Um, Utah has come out. I do apologize for not making a video. I'll try to get where I can take a run up there. And I rec uh, film, uh, record it, so we can see Utah. I've already been there a few times. Uh, mostly been driving, like I said, ACS trucks. Mostly the W900 and the 389. We'll have to leave that map up today, guys, because this uh, truck doesn't have a GPS. And no option for GPS, so which is kind of a shame. Hope everyone's doing well. Happy holidays, everyone is watching. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much for uh, things that's been on the channel. Um, that's why there hasn't been any recording going on for the channel. Um, you know, 
like the work schedule and then like I said they, when they updated the uh, drive it I don't know what they done but they really screwed things up I don't know guy, I, I don't really know if I like this truck. Will be a rainy day. We'll get us a thumbnail here very soon. We'll get one now. Oop. Kind of rusty at taking photos. Let me move it this way, see if I can get the trailer in too. There we go. There we go. Just kind of being quiet, guys, letting y'all hear that 444. Don't run a 444 much. Uh, it is a good engine. It's an older engine. It is a good engine, though, so. Just, just kind of being quiet. Um, another thing I want to do is some Call of Duty. Hmm, I don't know where that's coming from. I'll look at that and see what's called or not. It shouldn't be doing that lag. It may be one of these traffic mods I'm using. Um, I want to do some Call of Duty on the PlayStation. But I gotta check out some things. I don't know if my headset record will let me record with it. So I might have to look at that and see if, if that's the case. If, if that's the case, then I'm gonna try to, when I have a chance, I'm gonna try to do some Call of Duty because uh, I have the Call of Duty for the PlayStation 4 that I haven't even played yet. But I can tell you when Red Dead Redemption 2 releases for Steam, it will be over here on the channel. Uh, that's a guarantee. I'm not gonna, I on. know it's already out, but I, I'm not going to purchase it until it comes to Steam. Because I, I don't really use too much other than Steam. Um, everything, like I said, everything's going good with LS Speed and Far. Right now, everything's working good. Go I did go on. back, roll back to Jurisdiction 3. Um, just for time's sake. I really don't have the time that I want to have to keep Jurisdiction 4 going, you know, with the extra departments. I would love to do that. It's just so time consuming that I just don't, I don't have the time to do it, so. With Jurisdiction 3, I think we'll get enough um, in there that we'll uh, 
by the years. I tried to get a shorter run going up to uh, Utah and uh, I couldn't get one. It was too far. I mean, that's why we didn't run a load up there to Utah because uh, it was too far of a run to do in, in a video. So it was like close to 600 miles to where it wanted you to go. So. And, you know, and it's getting to be that way. Um, you know, with more states coming out, you know, obviously, you know, SCS has already said that they are, they have four states that they are working on right now. Um, when more comes out, you know, it's going to be hard to get short runs from what it used to be. Uh, it's got to be our traffic mod. One of these traffic mods that I'm running has got to be doing that because it shouldn't be doing that. It's got to be one of the Jesse Cat's uh, mods doing it. I may have to turn them on. Huh. I do apologize for that. I, I don't know what that is. I'm going to have to look into that. It wasn't doing that. Yeah, that's definitely got to be a traffic line. That's just this truck. I, I don't know what it is it would be. Um, I know that SCS did update uh, the game because they had some uh, bugs in Utah. Me personally, I haven't seen none of the bugs that they said they had. Uh, other people had seen them. I hadn't. Um, said something about the AI traffic would stop on hills so they couldn't make it up hills and they would just stop. Um, like I said, I haven't seen that issue myself. But, I know that they did update it, for that reason.
just kind of being quiet, listening to the rain, uh, driving this, uh, great truck. Um, that's one thing that I want to say, too. Uh, if, you, if you come over here to watch, like, a bunch of modded trucks, you're not going to see it here, guys. I mean, I drive one occasionally like this. I'll get one, and I'll drive it look, maybe once or twice, and, and then that's it. I go back to SCS trucks because the frame rates are better. Uh, you don't have as many, many issues with with their trucks as you do these modded trucks. Now, don't get me wrong. These modded trucks are great. The... The monitors like Viper and Outlaw, they do a great job, uh, you know, with their trucks. They're great mods, and they're great to use, and it's, we're, we're very fortunate to have them, you know, because we don't, you know. So, and I do use them, but I don't use them often. And I actually got this one off of um, ATS Mods. Uh, this trip was on there. And like I said, I do apologize for that lag. It's got to be a... Um, I'm wondering too if it may be this rain mod too causing those issues. I may have fucking that too and turn that off, see if that may be what it is too. Cause I am using a, a mod for the rain. It gives it a little bit a little bit better rain. More realistic, you know. Excuse me. And hit the microphone. Uh, I don't use a wheel, so my drive is not the best. I am using a Xbox One controller to, to drive, so it's not the best. It doesn't do too bad, but it, it's not the best. I'll uh, I'll admit it. Um, I do right now only have one driver. I've only hired one driver, which is okay. I mean, you know, not not a big issue. We're about 20 miles out, and we're about 23 miles out from our drop. Right. Kind of a short one. Just want to get in here and run and uh, use this uh, Outlaw's truck. Hadn't used it in a while. Keep left. Um. Let everyone know what's been going on with the channel. And I, I do apologize, you know, for not putting out content. It's not what I want. Um, you know, I, I did, like I just, I did say I do have a full-time job. So sometimes it just, it comes where I just do not have time to put anything out like I want. Keep right. Exit right. 
Exit right. Keep left, and then turn left. Turn left. Love sitting in traffic. then turn right. Um, another thing too, I am using a different um, real company's mod. I normally use the one that's on the workshop. I decided to use the one that, that you download off of a mod site. It updates every time the game updates with a new status of Just to try something different. Look, there's a few different companies in there that it's not on the other one. I'll probably go back to the other one. I do like the other one. I think a little bit better. Because it, it gives you um, real danger to the gas right. station and stuff too. So that's kind of one of the bigger reasons why I like the other one better. But I don't know, you know, not a good mind. Turn right. Alright. I don't know why we're taking this to Walmart, but this is where they said they want it. So this is where we're going to take it. We're going to take loose grain to Walmart. Your, your rap guidance is now finished. Alright, where well, they want it. Ooh, right there in the corner. Get turned around here.
Alright, we drove excellent. We drove 324 miles. It took us 6 hours and 37 minutes to get here. We consumed 68.2 gallons of fuel. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. I just want to get here and do this quick video. I'm using uh, Outlaws 379. I didn't see it on the mod site. I thought I'd, uh, I hadn't run it in a long time. I thought I'd check it out. Um, like I said, I don't run too many modded trucks. Uh, so it's occasionally that we'll, we'll run one like this. Um, just to see how, how can, what kind of updates has been done to it. You know, stuff like that. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And everyone have a happy holidays.